Ah, there's coyotes up here. Ooh, they're looking at me. Nice coyote. Nice coyote. Well, hello, there you are. Thank you for checking in. Well, today we're here starting the adventure here at Vietnam Veterans Memorial Park. A different section I wanna just explore today. Actually, the day started earlier with some errands and some uh, chores I had to do. I had to uh, get the oil changed in the car and whoo, I used to do all that stuff myself, but uh, when cars got more complicated, I started taking it to a uh, 10 minute lube and used to cost like $29. Guess how much I spent today? Now keep in mind, I did do a, an air filter and rotated the tires, but uh, ugh, 186 bucks, that's ridiculous. I feel taken, but that's okay. It's good for another 5,000 miles. But let's explore this area. I'm near uh, a, a road called Adelia and uh, I-25 down the road here, across the street from the Albuquerque High School. And I found this park and guess what? There's a bunch of, bunch of geese here. Let's go say hello. We sure have a lot of Canadian geese in this town. Drive around town, you'll see uh, quite the flock, if that's what they're called, uh, all over Albuquerque, anywhere there's an open field. I know they're gonna start wandering away from me, but it's all right, I won't harm you. It's strange that they're afraid of me because geese are notorious for being like a guard animal, like a guard dog. They're just walking away from me, walking away. Or are they circling me? Maybe, they, maybe they're circling me. Whoa, there they go. Okay, I'll stop bothering you. Nice to see you. Yeah, it's going to be a very eclectic video today. I'm in the Mart 
Tinas Town area. And just kind of looking around, whatever's around. Once in a while, I like to go to a cemetery if I'm close. Just kind of uh, reflect on life. Reminds me of a story. A guy went to a, uh, a counselor and he said, I just want to, can you just tell me a place where I can find where I don't have any more worries, any more struggles, any more heartaches? And he goes, well, let me, let me give you a map here. There, there is a place. It's in town here. He gave him the map and he goes, I'm not familiar with that part of town. He goes, I just follow it and you, you'll find a place. So he follows it all through the town and take it a while because it's way on the other side of town. And he pulls up and he goes, that's a cemetery. What is that doctor talking about? Takes him a while. Ah, there's coyotes up here. Oh, they're looking at me. Nice coyote. Nice coyote. Nice coyote. Stay that way. As he hurries back to the car, there's some big ones too. I didn't expect to run into coyotes or coyote, how do you pronounce it? Anyways, he's sitting there in front of the uh, in front of the cemetery and he goes, oh, I get it. There's no real relief. I mean, sometimes the problems are big, sometimes they're small, depending on your own uh, attitude and your own uh, point of view. But uh, uh, he finally got it and he goes, okay, I'll just live my life and then we'll finally have some peace. Okay, on to something a little more cheery. Nice little park here. Look at that view. I believe I've shown this before, but it's so cool. 1916. That was a couple years ago, huh? Now, most people call this area Martinez Town. But uh, it's actually Santa Barbara, Santa Barbara neighborhood. Very old buildings, it's really, really awesome. Little homage here. These old, old buildings are just fascinating. Love it. Had to stop and check out this old church here. It's right on the corner here in Albuquerque of uh, Edith and Lomas. Now this one isn't a library. This is give, take, free food. This guy's yelling over here. It's all right. It's all right. Calm down. This is awesome. I've never checked it out up close. I've driven by it. I don't know how old this is, but kind of a mission style architecture there. Very cool. Love it. Ah, there's a historic plaque up here. Bilingual ministry, Iglesia Presbyteriana. Nineteen twenty-two, I think it says. Oh yeah, right out here. It says eighteen eighty-nine to nineteen twenty-two. Not sure exactly what that period means, but... 
Well, what would a trip to Martinez Town be without a quick stop here at Martinez Town Park? I love this little park. Been here a couple times. It's a nice place for people to come that are visiting at the hospital, what have you. An incredible sculpture, a metal sculpture, around this whole thing. Pretty amazing. Pretty cool sculpture here. Even got plants growing in there. I think I've shown this before, but it's pretty amazing. It has a little pinwheel, and every little spoke of the wheel gives you a little history lesson. End of the war, organized territory of the US. Pretty, pretty, real darn cool. Now what's really special about uh, this park and parks like these is you're right in the middle of, well, there's downtown. There's some busy streets over here. You're right next to the hospitals where people are probably, probably suffering. And this little peaceful walkway right next to it. It's, that's the contrast of life, right? Well, I think that's going to do it, my friends. Otherwise, I could just keep going and going a whole day long. Too long of a video for now, but there's always more. More to explore, as I like to say. There's always more. Even the old stuff becomes new. <laughs> well, that's going to do it. I'm going to take a hike back to my car. Got to head out and do some more chores and errands. Thank you so much for tuning in today. My views are down uh, lately, so a little discouraged, but I'm going to hang in there with your encouragement. Well, be good to yourself, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.